A tsunami has hit Tonga's largest island, Tongatapu, and reportedly sent waves flooding into the capital after an underwater volcano in the South Pacific exploded in a violent eruption on Saturday, sending a cloud of ash and gas steam into the air. Satellite imagery shows a massive ash cloud and shockwave spreading from the eruption. Waves crossed the shoreline of Tonga's capital, Nukulofa, flowing onto coastal roads and flooding properties, according to CNN affiliate Radio New Zealand RNZ. A tsunami warning has been issued for the islands of Tonga. Tsunami advisories have also been issued as far away as New Zealand's North Island. The Hunga Tonga Hunga Heapai volcano first erupted Friday, sending a plume of ash 20 kilometers (12.4 miles) into the air, according to RNZ. A second eruption hit on Saturday at 5:26 p.m. local time, RNZ reported. Satellite imagery shows a massive ash cloud and shockwave spreading from the eruption. Waves from the eruption crossed the shoreline of Tonga's capital, Nukulofa, flowing onto coastal roads and flooding properties, according to RNZ. Australia's Bureau of Meteorology said it recorded a tsunami wave of 1.2 metres, about 4 feet near Nukulofa at 5.30 p.m. local time on Saturday. The volcano is located about 30 kilometres, 18.6 miles, southeast of Tonga's Fonyofo Island, according to RNZ. In addition to the tsunami warning, Tonga's meteorological services have issued advisories for heavy rain, flash flooding and strong winds in lands and coastal waters. The nearby island of Fiji has also issued a public advisory asking people living in low-lying coastal areas to move to safety in anticipation of the strong currents and dangerous waves. A tsunami advisory remains in place for all coastal waters of Samoa, according to the Samoa Meteorological Service. No evacuation is required, but members of the public are advised to stay away from beach areas, the agency said. A tsunami advisory has also been issued for coastal areas on the north and east coast of New Zealand's North Island and the Chatham Islands, where strong and unusual currents and unpredictable surges at the shore are expected, according to New Zealand's National Emergency Management Agency. New Zealand's official weather service said its weather stations across the country had observed a pressure surge on Saturday evening from the eruption. An earlier tsunami warning issued for American Samoa has since been cancelled, according to the NWS Pacific Tsunami Warning Center.